Today's video is all about the Magic Penny Magnet Kit. We'll talk about what it is, how it can be utilized for homeschool education, and by the end of the video, hopefully you have an idea if this product is good for you or if it's something you need to skip. The Magic Penny Magnet Kit is a STEM kit sponsored by the Institute of Physics and the Royal Institution of London. Anytime you put royal in front of something, it automatically sounds important. Welcome to the YouTube channel, The Royal Homeschool Sp It advertises having over 44 astounding feats of magnetism utilizing super strong magnets and various coins from England. Something I did not know before playing with this kit is the United States is in a very small minority of countries that don't use magnetic coins. The kit states it's for ages eight and up, but then it states it's not for children under three. So if your child is from the ages four to seven, I don't know what to tell you. The booklet that comes with it advertises the set as great for science investigations in the classroom and open exploration at home or community programs. Compared to some of the other kits we've reviewed, this is a pretty basic science kit, and I don't mean that as a critique. Unlike other physics kits, I just mean that it is singularly focused on magnetism. It comes with two strong magic penny magnets encased in stainless steel along with 32 newly minted British coins. And I must say, looking at these coins up close, it is pretty impressive the detail in Queen Elizabeth's crown. Should I say Queen Elizabeth II? Her royal Queen Elizabeth. Additionally, it comes with a booklet which includes 44 different activities and other magnet facts. You can see that the book is pretty small and concise. However, I do really like that they have included over 50 different questions with the demonstrations. The answers are in the back and these questions provoke additional thoughts and understanding and really justifies this as a purchase for homeschooling or other general educational needs. What's interesting about these magnets is how they differ from other traditional magnets and they were designed specifically that way. This bar magnet that we have for example, like most magnets, you can see the poles are at the ends. This is additionally visualized from the force lines using these iron filings. These particular magnets were manufactured and engineered so that the poles are on the side. Doing this allows your learner to do some pretty interesting builds. You can see here a majority of the iron filings are clumped toward the center. On a side note, if you have a macro lens or a microscope, it's pretty darn neat looking up close at iron filings form the force lines from the magnetic fields. All in all, in my opinion, I think this kit is perfect for two particular scenarios. You're a homeschooling parent and you just happen to be in need of a science tool that is engaging and hands-on for your kids, and you don't really have a specific topic you're interested in covering. You just know that you need to cover some science. Then instead of spending potentially hundreds of dollars on a physics pro or chemistry set, you can spend about 25 bucks and that can get you started. The second scenario, which I imagine will be way more common, is for the homeschooling parent or educator who is doing a dedicated unit on magnetism. Now there are all kinds of ways to do that without buying a specific magnetic kit. And we've covered a lot of them on our channel already. For example, when we built the simplest electric train, the gravity defying magnetic tube, how to use magnets to see the actual iron that is in your kid's cereal, and how to make a basic electromagnet. Those demonstrations are really fun to do, but they can be kind of tedious and time consuming to set up. So if you're looking for a hands-on demonstration about magnetism, but without having to go get too technical or buy a bunch of supplies, then this kit could easily fill that void. It's quick, easy, not terribly expensive, and it's completely reusable. The more time your kids spend with the kit, the more interesting the builds will get. And you can do a YouTube or Google search and you can find some incredible builds that can definitely provide some inspiration if you run out of ideas from the book that comes with it. In addition to the builds, the book advertises and the ones you can see online, my kids and I actually came up with a different game using this kit. It's almost kind of like a reverse Jenga. Basically, we would take turns adding coins to the magnet until somebody caused it to collapse. Oh! <laughs> It was actually very fun and everyone had a great time playing. If you're looking for a way to make learning about magnetism more hands-on and energizing, the Magic Penny Kit can definitely fill that void. Hopefully you'll find this video helpful. Have a great day, everybody, and I'll see you next week.